hello guys welcome back to my channel next tutorial in this video today I'm going to be showing you the steps on how to factor reset or hard reset your Samsung Galaxy A32 this particular device is with T-Mobile it's a very trick tricky way to get it done so follow the steps you won't have any issues first thing you want to turn off the device now if this phone has a pattern or password it's not going to let you to uh, turn that off so you want to plug it up to the charger and once you do that you want to press two buttons to force the phone to shut off which are the volume down and the power key press and hold until the device completely shuts off it's going to take about 10 to 15 seconds holding these buttons and it's going to turn off as soon as you see it powers back on and it shows the Samsung Galaxy logo keep holding until it shuts off then release all the buttons now you want to give it a couple seconds until it's showing you that it's charging as you see right here then you want to press two buttons which are the volume up key and the power key so just give it a couple more seconds until it shows that it's charging now you can go ahead and press those buttons and keep holding until you see the Samsung logo on the screen once you see that Samsung logo just release the power and keep holding the volume up key it will take you to the main menu where we're gonna be resetting this device once you get to the screen right here you wanna use the volume down key to navigate and you wanna select wipe data factor reset press the power key to confirm scroll down to the factor data reset the second option press the power key once more once that is done we're gonna go down to wipe catch partition press the power key down to yes then you can go ahead and reboot your system now and by pressing the power key this is it guys this is, concludes my t uh, video for the day if you found this video helpful to you make sure to hit the like and subscribe to my channel for more and thank you guys for watching I will see you next time